In this quick tutorial, I'll show you how to calculate the probability of events that are not mutually exclusive. If we have an event, let's say A and B, are not mutually exclusive, meaning that they can both occur at the same time, then the probability that A or B will occur is determined by adding the individual probabilities of A and B, and then subtracting the probability that A and B will occur simultaneously. That's mathematically represented right here, where we have the probability of A or B is equal to the probability of A, plus the probability of B, minus the probability of A and B. And just like before in our video about mutual exclusive events, we will use the union symbol, but in our statement we have this other symbol known as the intersection symbol, and that's another way of writing and. Our question reads, in a group of 25 baboons, 18 enjoy grooming their neighbors, 16 enjoy screeching wildly, while 10 enjoy doing both. If one baboon is selected at random, find the probability that it enjoys grooming its neighbor or screeching wildly. So we will write down the probability that it enjoys grooming or screeching and the probability of a baboon enjoying grooming their neighbor is 18 out of 25. The probability of baboons screeching wildly is 16 over 25 and the probability that they enjoy doing both is 10, minus 10 over 25. And this last fraction refers to this last part. Now adding and subtracting this isn't hard. We have the same denominator all throughout. So that's our common denominator. 18 plus 16 is 34, minus 10 is 24. So the probability that you will find a baboon that either likes to groom its neighbor or screech wildly is 24 out of 25. And there you have it. That is how to calculate the probability of events that are not mutually exclusive.